This tutorial is how to install a power button flex cable on a 2G first generation Apple iPhone. You can check out more tutorials by going to repairscratchedipods.blogspot.com. In order to complete this repair, you're going to need your iPhone, a screwdriver, a metal or a plastic spudger, and obviously the new um, ribbon flex with the power button on it. So first you're going to need to um, get the black battery door off. Mine's kind of broken so it kind of just pops off but you will need to use a uh, little plastic um, iPhone opening tool as well. So mine kind of just pops off like that and underneath it you will see that there are three um, little Phillips screws that need to be taken out. There's one in the middle and then one on the side right there and one on the right side as well. So you're just going to go ahead and take those out. Make sure you keep all the screws in a, a safe place. And then next you're going to slide the metal spudger on the sides of the case. Be really careful here because you can um, damage the iPhone and then lift it up it will be connected by a make sure you turn it off too that's something that I forgot to do and this is where the sim card comes out um, you can use a little paper clip to take it out as well um, I forgot to, to do to mention that earlier so turn the iPhone off if you haven't already it was kind of a stupid mistake And be careful because it will be connected and you don't want to rip anything or break anything. Take the met or the plastic spudger and just lift up the, the little connector. And if you can't get it, just resort to using your fingers like that. So then you can set the main iPhone part aside because we won't be using that anymore. And there are, you need to um, be careful with the eye or with the iPhone power button because it's it's put in there kind of oddly like it's not normal um, so take that out first and just see how it's connected and make sure you make note of how it's connected because you'll have to put it back in again obviously and I think there's about six or so screws just keep taking the ones out that you see and then moving the parts around to see uh, where the other ones are located. You do have to take the little um, vibration thing out first and there's a another one, another screw under there. And depending on where you bought your replacement parts, um, some will have like the metal on them, some won't, so you might need to to replace those. So Basically, putting in the new one, just make sure you make note of wh what screws you used where. I think they're all the same except for one, and that's the one that goes on the headphone jack. So just put everything back together that um, in the reverse order that you did when you took the other one out. It's pretty pretty easy. It It is kind of cumbersome, and this repair actually does take some time and patience because the parts are so small and it's depending on where you got your replacement part um, it's kind of hard to move some of the parts around sometimes I'm not sure what I was showing you there I think just where the screws go And the home or the not the home button, the power button is probably the most difficult part of this. Um, you have to slide it through the ribbon and put it in. I my video got screwed up, so I apologize for that. But make sure you know how to put the power button in. That's probably the hardest part of this repair. And there's other guides online as well. If this does not help you, I, I apologize for that. But just so once you get everything put back together, put the cover back on, uh, make sure it powers up. And my 
uh, silent ring button wasn't working. That's why I repaired this iPhone. Um, so then just put the screws back, the three screws that you took out in the beginning. And then just test everything to make sure that it is working properly. And I believe it is. So thanks again for watching. And comment, subscribe, and rate. Thank you. For more tutorials, please check out repairscratchedipods.blogspot.com. I appreciate the feedback, and thank you guys for watching.